Hello everyone, and welcome back to Unexplained History. In today's video, archaeologists have made a stunning discovery in Spain that could revolutionize our understanding of European history. After months of careful excavation, a team of experts uncovered an ancient coffin that has lain undisturbed for centuries. This mysterious find is said to contain secrets and artifacts that have the potential to rewrite history books. With its ornate carvings and intricate details, this coffin is unlike any other ever found in the region. This is a once-in-a-lifetime discovery that promises to change everything we thought we knew about European history, and the team of experts is working tirelessly to uncover its secrets. Get ready to be transported back in time and learn about the fascinating history of this amazing continent. But before we continue the video, please subscribe to our channel and don't forget to hit the bell icon. Let's start our video. The Barbaric Tribe The Visigoths were a so-called barbarian group who were ultimately successful in their fight against the Romans and brought the Roman Empire to its knees. They were an early Germanic people that engaged in warfare, and it was ultimately as a result of these conflicts that they ended up settling in southern Germany and subsequently Hispania between the 5th and 8th centuries AD. In time, the Visigoths established themselves in the region that is now Germany and Hungary. Nevertheless, they were subsequently forced out of those areas by invading barbarians. The Emperor Valens gave some Visigoths land in Roman territory, which were led by their general Friediger around 380 BC, but Visigothic king Shinda Swift passed the Visigothic Code, which made no difference between Roman and Visigoth subjects in Spain, and required that all citizens be treated equally before the law. This was the most important thing the Visigoths left behind in Spain. Even if a man in the family didn't agree, these laws made everyone in Hispania equal and gave women more rights. When the Visigoths came to Spain, they changed the culture there, which they then shared with other countries through trade. Their legal code and keeping important parts of Western civilization alive in Visigothic Spain are examples of their contributions to world culture. Visigoth sarcophagus containing human remains. The ruins of a Roman villa can be seen in the southern region of Spain. It is a coffin that has been carefully kept and decorated, with intricate geometric patterns and ivy leaves that intertwine with one another. According to Mercia today, the tomb dates back to the time when the Visigoths attacked lands that had been ruled by the fallen Roman Empire in the 6th century BC. While conducting excavations at Los Villaricos, a large Roman agricultural community constructed about the 1st century BC, Archaeologists from the University of Murcia discovered a coffin measuring around 6.5 feet in length. The Visigoths converted a large stretch of land, known as the Villa's Acres, into a Christian basilica. This land had previously been utilized by the owner of the house to host important guests. In addition to it, they constructed an acropolis on the adjacent patio area at Santos, which is a religious cemetery. The archaeological dig was conducted in three distinct phases. The first thing that they are doing is cleaning up a mountain that may have been the source of water for the villa. Second, they are making headway in the location that we refer to as the pool area, which was used to manufacture and store things about which we do not have a lot of information. Thirdly, they desired to complete excavating the graves that were located above the chambers of the villa which had been abandoned between the latter half of the 5th century and the first half of the 7th century. The Roman Villa of Los Villaricos The Romans constructed a sizable agricultural villa at Muller, which is now known as the Roman Villa. There is a settlement located on the banks of the Mula River that has been inhabited for a few hundred years. Given the size of the location, only a portion of it has been investigated up to this point. The villa is similar to other wealthy Roman agricultural villas in Hispania that have well-preserved indications of significant farming. These villas can be found in Spain. The Los Villaricos villa was equipped with both an olive press and a storage facility for the olive oil that was produced on the premises. The Decline of the Roman Empire 
Farming was a Roman activity. The owner of the villa discontinued any economic activity shortly after the fall of the Roman Empire in the early 6th century AD instead. A small band of Romans decided to settle down in the region. People during this historical period made what they had, including the construction of a distinct semicircular edifice that was used solely for religious activities. A cemetery with graves is located relatively near the cemetery walls. There are a few straightforward graves that are marked by large slabs of sandstone on top and smaller stones on the sides. Due to the surprising nature of the discovery, the municipal department, independent researchers, and students have come together to collaborate on further investigation. Consequently, the finding of this coffin in Spain has sent shockwaves through the archaeological community. This discovery has far-reaching ramifications and will certainly alter all we thought we knew about European history. It is a monument to the dedication of archaeologists and the awe-inspiring nature of human history. We cannot wait to see what other discoveries they make and what they reveal about our past. Thanks for watching. I hope you have enjoyed the video. Give this video a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. See you in the next video.